Hey everyone, so we were out here in Wichita visiting the Homeboy cartoon and he's like, hey, I got another homeboy out here named Juan who's got some bikes and uh, do you want to interview him? And I'm like, let's do it. So we ate some tacos real quick and shut out here real quick. So Juan, hey brother, thank you for Dude, having us out here, man. I appreciate that a lot, man. So, I mean, you can't even beat this background, man. I mean, you got all these bikes and like, right lined up in front of the car. So can you tell us a little bit about the bikes, bro? Like. What's up with the bikes? Simon can see. Well, I mean, I just got back into the low riding game literally like a year and a half ago. Okay. I fell out. You know, I had my first low rider when I was 15 years old. It was a 91 Chevy S10 metallic blue on some golds. And, uh, you know, I had it for a year and a half. Uh, went, uh, went to school. So, uh, you know, I kind of went off to the side and uh, a couple years later got back in the game. Um, decided, you know, now that, you know, I'm on my feet now, you know, hey, let's get back on. And uh, yeah, I've been back in the game about a year and a half ago, and uh, I mean, this is what I got. I got a couple more rides, you know, getting fixed up right now as well. But uh, as far as the bike game goes, you know, I mean, it's a little something of what I got right here. If y'all want to come over and check yeah, it out, yeah, go check know. them out. And just to, I'm gonna let everybody know, we're in Kansas, so we're in the winter time, even though today's actually a nice day. So everybody's cars are getting something done to them. Mine's getting painted right now. Everybody's just getting hydraulics done or different things because this is our off season. So. Uh, but yeah, these are nice, bro. So just tell us about the bikes. Simone, uh, this one right here was more of a Dodger themed bike. I mean, it's getting there. It's not all the way complete. Right. Um, but uh, yeah, it's a little something. You know, it's uh, 144 spokes, uh, 20 inch handlebars. Uh, this one's more of a show bike. You know, it doesn't pedal. You know, it's standing on its pedals <laughs> or whatever. You know, it's not rideable, but, uh, but it Simone. looks good. Hey, it looks good. Hey, so Simone tell me, so Dodgers because you're originally from East LA, yeah? Simone, I was born in East LA, uh, right three streets down from Whittier Boulevard, from the actual Whittier Boulevard sign. You know, yeah. I remember uh, as a child walking down Whittier Boulevard and uh, seeing all the lowriders. You yeah. know, as a, as a child, you know, and uh, you know, hoping hey, so I was get one day, you know, I'll get there. That's and uh, I'm here now, you know. You're here now, brother. So tell us about nowhere. this one. You got. This girls, is, yeah, this is actually, Schwinn, yeah? see, what's an original Schwinn right here? It's uh, my daughter's uh, lowrider bike, as a matter of fact. Uh, she hasn't seen it, so hopefully she don't see this video before <laughs> it comes out, because I still have some things to do to yeah. it. You know, I got to add the mirrors, um, forks, etc. you know? And, uh, but yeah, I mean, it's uh, it's original Schwinn girl's bike. Nice. Um, this one as well, I just picked this one up actually about a week ago, nice. or whatever, you know, it changed out the tires, put the handlebars on it, or whatever, you know. 16? Um, yeah, Simone, this 16. Okay. Yeah, it's a 16, and uh, I was gonna paint it, but then I figured, you know, I'm just gonna go ahead and keep it original, you know, you got the original Schwinn, it's a, yeah. uh, bought here in uh, Kansas, or whatever, it's on them Schwinn, so I figured I'd, let, I'd leave the tags yeah, on there, you know, uh, you know, keep it original. This one right here, it's uh, this is actually my favorite bike. It's because it's more rideable than anything, you know. I right. love riding this thing. Every single bike here feels different, you know. Mm -hmm. Even though the handlebars look the same, it's just a low rider bike. You sit on one of these, it's nothing like you know sitting down on it, you know, getting the feeling of each bike. Right. Um, you know, you won't know until you actually sit down on it and actually, you know, do the damn thing right. or whatever. You know, these things are one of those things that look cool on TV. Um, on your phone or whatever but it's nothing like seeing them in real life you know in person or whatever you know absolutely um and taking a ride in one of these things yeah. these things are neck breakers everywhere with me i take my sons out you know we take we take uh rides down the river you know we're breaking necks everywhere we go you know thumbs up everywhere you know yeah it's all good people love it you know yeah I love and um, yeah my kids love it as well you know um this is my this is gonna be my nephew's maroon this is a maroon bike now mm -hmm. it's on it's in process it's actually gonna be about a salona bike it's oh, uh, okay. for my nephew or whatever you know we got the fender cartoons actually making the fender and uh it's gonna have the barsa logo along with my nephew's uh name on there you know okay um this one right here, um, yeah, me and Cartoon put this one together, and uh, this is off of uh, Buick. Uh, uh, the, <laughs> I saw that. The Simone, the uh, hood ornament off of yeah. a Buick, but uh, yeah, I mean, it goes it goes well, you know, with the green or whatever. Somebody's gonna know. see this and they're gonna need it for their car. They're yeah, they're gonna they hit you gonna, up. Yeah. <laughs> Simone, so it's got the, you know, we got the bird cage on it, you know, a little bit twisted here and there or whatever, you right. know. Um, still got some work to do to it as well you know um, this is my white and gold one right here well not mine it's my son's as a matter of fact you know um, yeah I used to be cartoons old bike when it came around and uh, I took it to him to fix things here and there he was like this is my old bike you know I'm like Simone you know so things get handed around here here and there but it's my son's bike now um, 
he's, we still got more gold parts to add to it or whatever, but this one for some reason, you know, catches the most attention out of all of them, you know. So I also Everyone noticed you got some way. project cars here. You got Lincoln here, you got Fleetwood over here. Simone, yeah, and uh, I got another Cadillac over another here. Another Cadillac Lincoln over here, here. another Lincoln. Simone, and uh, I got an 85 Cutlass uh, switched up. That's getting four Lincoln right now as we speak. Yeah. Simone. That's good, bro. So uh, how'd you end up in Wichita, Kansas? Uh, my parents moved us here uh, from East LA when I was about uh, eight, nine years old. And uh, from there, you know, I grew up here in, uh, in Wichita, Kansas. But still every year I go to LA, you know, take a visit down to South Central uh, on Florence. And uh, out in East LA, by the Vino as well, you know. That's good, brother. So that's good. You got your, your transplant like me. Simone. You know, I came here from California too, man. This is a cool spot. So one of the things, man, we like to do is show the the culture and one of the things we emphasize is that you don't have to be you know a gang member or anything negative to be in this lifestyle and so you yeah. know really want the kids to see that you could do this without having to do the negative piece so anything you want to tell the kids uh you know hey so i was gonna stay in school keep low riding you know i mean if you want a hobby this is it right here trust me i mean this thing will get you you know up off your ass you know trying to get some something done and uh from the bikes it evolves over to the cars you know the cars is something else you know and uh, the car shows uh, the cultura el ambiente el desmadre at the car shows you know it's all good you know i really really recommend it you know i i got all my kids into it you know all my right. kids are now into it i got all my homeboys into it you know and we're starting to back up you know here in wichita that's good are you in a car club too i'm, I'm not i'm not in uh right now as in right now you know i'm a solo rider uh -huh. you know and i got a lot of solo riders that follow me um but yeah i mean you know we're, we're, we're hanging in there you know that's good bro and i know we're that the, the thing. over here at the in wichita you guys have the wichita super show which is amazing yeah uh, we do that every year in october i love it man i was down here with uh, i don't know if you saw the low rider cop car that we built yeah the one from Malaysia. from Malaysia, yeah, yeah, yeah pretty, man pretty badass. so we're it. doing some more stuff to that one here soon and we'll come back uh you know this year and and we're actually going to go to albuquerque and then come back out to the you know super show out here and and show it off. Run a little competition with the Albuquerque uh, cop car. Right. Out there. Of course, that one was painted by uh, Rob, you know, Vander's life, which is a homeboy. Shout out to Rob. <laughs> so it's hard to compete with Rob. But, Simone. but uh, hey, man, thanks for uh, having us out here and showing us your bikes and you're, you're extremely talented. And uh, once you get that car out of the shop and it's ready to go, hit me up and yeah, we'll come sure. back. Yeah, man. we'll come back. Yeah. All right, brother. Let's well, thank you so Simone. much, brother, for having Simone. us. I appreciate it. Well, everybody, I uh, hope you enjoyed this episode, and uh, we'll be back soon.